you could just stick your tongue straight out here. Patients who are diagnosed with lesions in their mouths are usually only given a couple of options. They can do nothing, have their dentist keep a close eye on the lesions and hope they're not cancerous, or they can have them cut out and biopsy to know for sure. Neither option is ideal, which is why Eva Sue Reed chose a third option. She signed up to help test a new gel designed to treat the lesions, although that too had its limitations. I put it on my gums and after just a short time, you know, maybe five minutes or so, it started to kind of dissolve in my mouth and you didn't even see it after just a few minutes. So researchers at Ohio State University's Comprehensive Cancer Center have helped to design this, a tiny saliva-proof patch. The idea behind a patch would be that it would hold it in place much like a nicotine patch or some other type of drug delivery patch that people might be familiar with. On that patch is a potent medicine made with high levels of a man-made vitamin A. Doctors think it could be very effective in treating mouth lesions, although tests in pill form raised concerns. At high levels, it's, it's toxic. Patients develop trouble with uh, sores in their mouth with changes in lipid profile, dry skin. Which is where the patch comes in. In lab tests, it delivered medicine directly into the lesion with up to 97% efficiency, but didn't affect the rest of the body. We actually would like to see a minimal amount of compound uh, released into the bloodstream, and in fact, that was the case. Which could someday mean a new option for patients like Eva Sue, one that treats her lesions and spares her the painful process of repeated biopsies. At Ohio State University's Comprehensive Cancer Center, this is Clark Powell reporting.